Behold, I come as a thief. Blessed is he that watches and keeps his clothes, lest he walk naked and they see a shame. For a miracle, what is to come? Revelation chapter 17. And there came one of the seven angels, which had the seven vials. And talked with me, saying unto me, Come here, I will show unto thee the judgment of the great whore that sits upon many waters, the melting pot, the land of many languages, peoples, with whom the rulers of the earth have committed fornication, and the inhabitants of the earth have been made drunk with the wine of a fornication. So he carried me away in the spirit into the wilderness, and I saw a woman sitting upon a scarlet red colored beast full of names of blasphemy, having seven heads and ten horns. And the woman, or statue, was arrayed in purple, blue, and scarlet red color, and decked with gold and precious stones and white pearls, having a golden cup and her hand lifted up, full of abominations and filthiness of her fornication. And Upon her forehead was a name written, Mystery, that city like unto Babylon the Great, the mother of harlots and abominations of the earth. And I saw the woman drunken with the blood of the saints and with the blood of the martyrs of Jesus. And when I saw her, I wondered with great admiration. And the angel said unto me, Wherefore didst thou marvel? I will tell thee the mystery of the woman and of the beast that carries her, which has the seven heads and ten horns. The beast that thou sawest was, and is not, and shall ascend out of the bottomless pit, and go into perdition. And they that dwell on the earth shall wonder, whose names were not written in the book of life from the foundation of the world. When they behold the beast that was, and is not, and yet is. And here is the mind which has wisdom. The seven heads are seven mountains, on which the women sit. And there are seven rulers, I were fallen, and one is, and the other is not yet come. And when he comes, he must continue a short space. And the beast that was, and is not, even he is the eighth, and is of the seven, and goes into perdition. And the ten horns which thou saw are ten rulers, which have received no kingdom as yet, but receive power as rulers one hour with the beast. These have one mind, and shall give their power and strength unto the beast. He shall make war with the Lamb, and the Lamb shall overcome them. For he is Lord of Lords, and King of Kings. And they that are with him are called, and chosen, and faithful. And he said unto me, The waters which you saw, where that whore sits, are statue, of peoples, and multitudes, and nations, and tongues, the melting pot. 
and the ten horns which thou saw upon the beast. You shall hate the whore, and shall make her desolate and naked, and shall eat her flesh and burn her with fire. For God has put in their hearts to fulfill his will, and to agree, and give the kingdom or nation unto the beast, until the word of God shall be fulfilled. And that woman, or thing we so saw, is that great city, great city, which reigns over the rulers of the earth. Abba Father. Amen.